from the Guide Dog Foundation. That's his trainer. She'll be training Izzy till he's about a year and a half, and then he will go to somebody in need. And part of that training involves statues and costumes. Talk about that. Yeah, absolutely. So with the holidays rolling around, we see a lot of little ornaments in people's yards that are big and can be a little bit intimidating if you've seen those big blow-up things. Mm -hmm. And then last week, Izzy even got to meet the Chick-fil-A cow. So if you think about it, these objects, they don't blink, and people in costumes usually make kind of funny movements that he's not used to seeing, and so it can be a little bit intimidating and scary for puppies. So my goal as his puppy raiser is to teach him not to be afraid of those things so that when he's a working guide dog, they don't distract him. He's able to see them and walk right past them. Okay. How does he do with Christmas trees? Because we're concerned about Barnaby and our tree and him going after it. How's Izzy doing with the tree? He doesn't seem to mind it. He's most interested in the water in the base of it, so right. I don't want him to drink that, but he's totally fine with them. Okay, now has Izzy met Santa yet, though? He has not met Santa. <gasps> oh, that's got to be a big step in the training. <laughs> yeah, we'll have to go to the mall and see if we can get some pictures. All right, fantastic. Well, Izzy, once again, just kind of doing his thing right here. Lauren Cobb, thank you so much for coming out. Thank you. Izzy